So today I'm going to be showing you how to record, or excuse me, how to um, download Hypercam to the free version and use it. So here we go. <coughs> First thing I want to do is open up Internet Explorer. Give it a second here. <coughs> okay, so now um, you're gonna want to go to Google, and I've got Google open basically here. Um, and what you're gonna want to type in is hypercam2, and then I would suggest the download that CNET, which is this one right here. Um, this one is just kind of reliable. Um, and once you have this page loaded in here, okay, so um, once you have this page loaded, you're just going to click download the latest version and go through the setup. I'm not going to do that since I already have it downloaded. But once you have it open, um, this is how you do it. You can select your window, which is just select, and then you can click on a window. It's like region, which is click and drag across whatever you want to show on the screen. You can go to sound, um, and that will let you record sounds like I'm doing now. Um, and there's just a record sound button. You do have to have a microphone to do that. You can plug in a microphone, or uh, if you have a microphone built in, you can use that too. Um, but basically, you go to your ABI file, hit Browse, click where you want to save it, and once you have it saved, you go to Screen Area, and if you have this done, this uh, selecting, you can just hit Start Recording, and <coughs> once you start recording, you can do whatever you want. And this is kind of important, when you're done recording, sometimes it won't let you just click on the hypercam, and you'll have to right click, and hit restore to get it to pop back up, and then hit stop recording. So, anyway, this has been a short video on how to download hypercam. Thanks. Bye.